The day after state Democrats announced their plan for a rebate on the state level, Republicans are now following their lead. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Erica Arias is just back from the state capitol with the story. Erica. Well, Kara, we're not in a recession yet, but House Republicans say they're trying to ward off an economic downturn by helping the middle class and those struggling to heat their homes. Now, if this proposal passes and if you qualify, you could get a tax credit of up to $1,000. It's been, uh, been difficult making ends meet with the uh, rising cost of utilities and gas. Marisa Pryor isn't alone. The high cost of energy affects just about everyone. And Pryor says she feels the pinch with every monthly bill. We freeze all the time and it's like, oh my God, the bill is still that high. State legislators are trying to ease the stress of energy costs. Yesterday, the Democrats unveiled a tax rebate and fuel assistance plan. And today, House Republicans went over their outlook on the upcoming session with short-term relief in the form of a credit against your income tax. Everyone uh, clamors about the rising cost but, of life, but there's no more rising cost that's so uncontrollable than energy and health care costs. The proposed program would offer a $500 tax credit for home heating assistance and another $500 credit to offset out-of-pocket medical costs. It's aimed at helping out the middle class for households that earn $150,000 a year or less. This is our way to say, hey, if they exceed the unreasonable, uh, we'd like to give you a helping hand. Any little uh, breaks that we can get would be a huge help. I think it's a good idea. Uh, anything would help. And the relief package would not create a deficit. Instead, the proposed program would use about $200 million of the state's surplus. House Republicans are trying to fast-track the proposal. They hope it's approved in March so it can be applied in time for 2007 income tax returns. If the proposal passes after you file your return, you'll just have to file an amendment to get that additional credit if you qualify. Erica Arias, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.